Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, I am going to show you how to solve this given quadratic equation by simple factoring technique. And we can see that this problem has a big kind of numbers, so we have to be a little bit careful. Very first thing, I want you to just focus on the leading coefficient, it is one. Just keep in your mind. And our next step is, I want you to write down this constant number, the number on the very right hand side, on the top of this x factor, 3, 0, 6, 2, 5. And the middle number over here, which is positive 5, 76, is going to go at the bottom of this x factor. Now our next uh, problem is this one. We need to find the factors of this 3, 0, 6, 2, 5. Don't worry about this negative sign. We'll take care of it later on. Let me show you how to find the factors of these one. So let me write down somewhere here. 3, 0, 6, 6, 2, 5. And I want you to just focus on this thing. You know that the last two digits are 25. That means this number is divisible by 25. So this could be factored out to 25 times 12, 25. So far, so good. Once again, you can see the last two digits are 25. That means I can again factor it out 25 times 49. So far so good. So that means this 30625 could be written as 25 times 25 times 49. So that means this number 30625 could be written as the factor of 25 times 25 times 49. Here I want you to go ahead and multiply these two numbers. 25 times 25 is 625 and I want you to just put down, bring down this times 49. And you can see that 625 times 49 is going to give you this number 30625. That means our factors turns out to be 625 and 49. Now the next step is we need to fix the signs. Since this is a positive 576, that means this is going to become positive 625 and negative 49. So these are our two factors, positive 625, negative 49. If you multiply them, you're going to get this number, negative 30625. And if you add them, you're going to get negative, rather positive 576. Here is our next step. Our next step is going to be I want you to put down two parentheses since we are going to to factor this one out. So the first is I want you to write down x over here and x over here. And next thing is what you got over here. This is positive 6 to 5. Just write down positive 6 to 5. One factor. The other one is negative 40 nine on this side and we have a right equal to zero so far so good now since we have a two factors equal to zero you can separate them you can split them up i'm going to put down x plus 625 equal to zero and x minus 49 equal to zero here if you move this side so x equals to negative 625 is one of our solution and here x equal to positive 49 is another solution. Hence negative 625 and positive 49 is our solution set and that is our answer. And here is your assignment as usual. Can you solve this given quadratic equation by 
using the quadratic formula. You can take your time. You can pause the video. Luckily, I have already uploaded this video as well. Go ahead and check it out and see the correct answer and the correct way. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.